Hi everybody, it's Jessica from Three Rivers Homestead and today we're having an outdoor day of work here on the homestead. It's supposed to be beautiful, 60 degrees and sunny and the temps drop a little bit later this week so we're trying to take advantage of the weather. The kids were up and doing school by 8 o'clock and some of them have finished so we're out here. Um, the younger four are playing and uh, I have a couple projects. My first one is this rain barrel or this tote we got it last year and we hooked it up as a rain barrel, but um, it had obviously an algae problem because it's opaque and was letting sunlight in to let algae grow. So before I get it hooked up to the gutter system this year, I'm going to um, wrap this in a black plastic tarp and hopefully that'll solve our problem and then we can use this to water plants and um, fill the duck pool and things like that. So that is my first chore for the day. Proving to be a little more difficult than I thought. We're trying to find something to remove these bars here on the top. I've got to get these taken off before I can pull the plastic toad out and get it wrapped up. So thankfully I have Adam home and he's working on that for me. But oh, it's such a beautiful day. Your baseball bat? Look. Yeah. There you go. My hero. Do what you like, kid. Adam got it all moved in place for me and it's ready to go. We're supposed to get some good rain this weekend so that can fill up and then I can clean it out really well once it's all full and then it'll be ready to fill up tubs for these ducks right here. <laughs> And then my second job for today is to finish up moving this big pile of wood chips. We had a massive um, maple tree taken down right here and over the weekend Adam worked very hard with uh, the big boys to get the wood moved over here. So he'll be busy splitting that all this week. And then I was blessed with all of these leftover um, wood chips from the stump that I can use in my garden pathways. So I worked on it a bit Saturday but with this belly here, there's only so much I can do before I have to stop and take a break. And so the goal today is to move the rest of this into the garden. I'm going to get started on that. Got my Gracie girl bringing me a wheelbarrow. Thank you, honey, that's a big help. Over the weekend, I um, got all of these wood chips laid down on this garden path here. 
and underneath it is just a layer of cardboard and so that's what I'm working on doing a little more of today. We have these four little cinder block beds. They're built for each of the four big kids. And so I'm starting to lay cardboard in the path around them and I'm gonna fill it in with wood chips. It'll make it look really nice. That's a little better. Got a nice clear pathway now. I have to have clear pathways for the kids or else they'll step on plants. So that makes me feel a little better. There's still some work to do. I gotta finish up the pathways here. It's a time of year the garden just sort of looks like a junkyard. But, um, but yeah, we're getting there. We got about a month to go. We actually have two large gardens. This one that I'm working in today is um, where it's mostly perennials and uh, our spring crops go in here. And then we have another large garden I haven't even touched yet. It's so overwhelming right now to think about what I need to do in there. But that other garden is uh, most of our summer crops like our tomatoes, peppers, um, beans, things like that. So my goal right now is to just get this uh, spring garden ready to go and planted here in the next couple of weeks and then as soon as I get that done I can till up the summer garden and transplant all of my starts that have been in the house but I'm feeling good it feels better every little bit that I can get done is one step closer so I've just got to look at it that way otherwise it's overwhelming if I think about the big picture of everything that needs done and um, I'm starting to get out of breath and it's getting harder to move around with this big belly I'm 32 weeks pregnant now so yeah it's a uh, I don't know we're getting there this will keep me in shape and active and prepared for labor though so there's the blessing Too low. So we hung up, we hung up really high on that chain And then we were like, but there's a branch in the way. So we were like, well, maybe we'll just hang it higher on there, but there wasn't any good branches. And the girls. filling up. Oh, maybe we'll make some dandelion salve. Can you get it in there? Good job. Uh-oh. Well, it's been a pretty busy day here. Got a lot of work done outside and accomplished both of the big projects that I wanted to get done, but I am pretty tired now and my body's aching. So I am gonna take a break now and sit here and swing with my baby and watch the big kids play. And then I gotta go in and 
figure out what I'm going to do for lunch for these guys. But for now, I'm going to sign off here and say um, goodbye. I uh, hope you're having a blessed day on this beautiful April day. And we'll see you again soon. Say bye-bye. 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 <laughs>